good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you may be at. I've seen a lot of videos of, of villas in Bali, a lot of beautiful pictures, uh, but one thing I'm not seeing a lot of is price breakdowns. Uh, Instagram, YouTube, Facebook, TikTok, whatever platform you can name, people are showing videos of beautiful places in Bali, and all across the world for that matter. But you know what they're leaving out? How much did that cost a night? And for this particular video, I want you to see how much I paid uh, for about a week in Bali. All right, truth be told, um, you really can't go to Bali and stay in a condo, an apartment, a house. I feel that the experience is in the privacy of staying in a secluded area Maybe not secluded as far as the city, uh, but a secluded area as in a private residence uh, where um, you don't have the hotel noise, you don't hear footsteps beside you, underneath you, on top of you, um, and you have a peace and quiet space to yourself with a pool right outside of your door. You really can't beat that. You really can't beat that. So here's my Airbnb price breakdown. Uh, before I get too deep into this, I will say that um, I probably looked at, you know, 20 or 30 villas uh, with pools prior to choosing this one. Um, I am big on reviews. Uh, I'm not saying that people just don't complain to be complaining. Uh, but if I see more than one re bad review, um, I am turned off. Um, you could find this place if you are looking for it, take into consideration. You might have to, you know, wiggle your dates around uh, to get the exact place that you want. Um, I had to do that. Uh, but here is the price breakdown. You're going to spend about $120-some a night. Everyone knows that Airbnb has fees. That's nothing new. That's nothing new to anybody. Uh, so that's going to add another... Uh, $120 uh, to your total price. But $124 a night for a private villa uh, where you can literally jump from your bathroom inside of the pool can't be beat. I spent about $120, if not more, probably a little more, getting a hotel in the States, staying at a Marriott in the States. I'm a Marriott person. But staying at a Marriott in the States. That hotel plus the fees is going to run me more than $124 a night. So I would highly suggest uh, getting a villa. I would highly suggest going for the privacy. Um, there are other places that have villas um, or places to rent, but I would highly suggest Airbnb. Spend $124 a night and enjoy yourself and have that privacy. All right? Until next time. I'm out.